guys so today is the first day in Green Haven as you can see on the screen right here it says like what we were doing and everything today and we had baseball games and everything like that so yeah there's me walking in the there's like a park right, right near the baseball field the first game we lost and the second game we won by a little bit and there's some pictures of it and yeah that's pretty much it for the picture and this is the third day of Green Haven because they were both combined that and so this was beach day we were at the that's where i when i got to the beach it was taking like video of all the the lake and everything like that and i we decided to go on a walk across like the there's like a bridge there so that's me on the bridge some photos from the bridge and like a lot of photos from the bridge it's of the ocean there's me a lot of the, all these photos are on my instagram i posted them a little bit ago and yeah and there's a picture of me and my dad And then there's a picture, another picture of me, which is honestly, this is honestly one of my favorite photos. I forgot to, and then there's a picture of me and my friend. We decided to do some, try to do some jumping photos, which was a little bit hard to do because we kept messing it up. So, some of these photos. And then one of our friends photobombed us and we were like kind of embarrassed, but yeah, it was funny. And then we had a fourth day in Grand Haven, which most people were gone and I was really sad. But it, we went on, decided to go on like some vacation. So I ate breakfast in the morning as usual, and then my um, most of my friends left, and I was so sad, and I definitely cried. But then we um, drove up to Holland for the first part of the day. We ate lunch, and this was like I got like a bacon mac and cheese, and then we went um, on a beach in Holland. There's a picture of like the lighthouse. There's a picture. There's a video of me on the beach, me walking across like another bridge. I think there's might have gone in Grand Haven for some reason. And I think that's just like Michigan thing, I don't know. And then we traveled again and went to Sagata, I think that's how you say it, but it kept, for some reason on the Google Maps, long story, it kept saying Sagaduck for some reason. So then there's a picture of me, I was posing, trying to be like one of those Instagram models, but obviously failing. And then we drove to Traverse City, this was all a family trip, just me and my mom my dad and my brother and it, it's our tradition to do pretty much every year which is very fun so we ate drove up we had lunch here this was like a salad with tuna on it it was really i do not, i don't even know what that is and one of our tra traditions while we're in grand or traverse city whatever is to go to cherry republic and this is what we got we got that those are me and my brother's favorites and you enjoyed that little beach break and now this is a view from my hotel room of the sunset it's always so pretty there it's where we like are right on the beach it's our hotel that we always go to and then this was traverse city day two we always we have a lot of traditions but one of our favorites is dune climbing and we always get sandwiches from this one shop and they're is yeah i think we've been doing it for a couple of years now i forgot to take photos but this one is not one of the dunes you climb it's just on like this tour that you take through your car and yeah then this is our favorite restaurant there called firefly again did not take a photo but they have like sushi and stuff there and it's always so good that was our last day <laughs> So, as you can see on the screen, we ha we're going on our third vacation to go see my cousin in Boston. My first time to Boston, actually, which I had the best time, and I miss Boston so much. 
we had a whole, our cousin that lived there had her whole itinerary printed out, and we went to her apartment at like 9 a.m. The flight was at 7, so I was very exhausted. I woke up at 4 a.m., and I got coffee, which is very rare. It was interesting. But anyway, we went on this boat tour of Boston. My brother and me both got to drive, and I was very nervous in the next picture that you will see. I looked excited, but I was nervous because... I didn't know exactly how to steer. I'd never done that. But then we went to the an oyster house by train, and it's one of the oldest oyster houses, I think, or oldest restaurant, I think, in the U.S., I believe. And then I was feeling myself another Instagram thing, or trying to be an Instagram model, but again, failing. So then we, this was our next itinerary. We went to a lot of brunches there because we woke up late. But me and my cousin both got this, and it was really good. It was like a mac and cheese with pulled pork on top. Then we went to the aquarium, which was genuinely really cool. There's my cousin, my dad, and my brother posing. And there's a turtle who's really old. I don't know why I said that, but yeah, the turtle's really old. There's me and my, or not me, my brother and my cousin posing with my brother's new stuffed animal. And then I got a bucket hat and I really loved it and I will wear it all the time from now on. Then we went to an art fair which was a very cool experience. We got some sunsets after we went to, like, a brewery for some appetizers because I'm always getting that content. I actually ran away from my family just to take photos of this because I thought it was beautiful, the sunset, sunset of this and the body water. And then we went to an Irish pub and had a lot of fun there. Then the final day, I was very sad because I had a lot of time there, a lot of fun time there. And we got Dunkin'. They have really good coffee, and this is also on my Instagram story, I believe. Not anymore, but... We went to a tour of Fenway around, like, 11. If you're wondering why the field look weir looks weird, it's because uh, there was a concert going on there. They actually have a garden there growing all the fresh produce, and there's some of their trophies from all of their wins that they have. And another photo. This is from the Green Monster. In Boston, they actually don't pronounce their A's, or, yeah, A's at all, and they also pronounce, no, they pronounce A instead of R. But yeah, a lot of photos and a very great tour. A lot of history in Boston. And I think I'm now a Red Sox fan. So that's good. There's some other photos. And then we walked around and went on a Freedom Trail tour. And this was our last photo there. For the Freedom Trail is very a lot of history too. And then we went to an Italian dinner. Hope you guys enjoyed this voiceover vlog. And yeah.